Hi, right, so it's a beautiful sunny morning. I'm here in Green Hill Gardens, so let me show you around. So I'm just sitting at the top of Green Hill Gardens at the moment. You get a wonderful view of Weymouth Bay over there. You just see the top end of Portland over the top of No Fort. Got a beautiful view of the bay. It's a sunny May morning. There's cruise ships out on the sea. Um, we're just coming to the end of the lockdown. But, um, there's been cruise ships out on the bay for um, well, a couple of months. But we've had Queen Victoria, the Azura, Aurora, Britannia, Ventura, Queen Mary 2. There's been loads of different ones out there. But as you can see, beautiful, beautiful views. So this is regarded as one of the best gardens in, in England, apparently. Um, it's been awarded the, the Green Flag Award um, numerous times, and it's, it's been recognised for I don't know, the previous five, six years, apparently. Um, it was originally private gardens up until 1902 when it was handed to the local council. And um, now it's here for the public to enjoy. Green Hill Gardens 2020. This is one of the um, awesome flower beds that they have in the gardens here. Um, these ones are obviously work in progress at the moment. And they also have this one here. This one at the moment is commemorating the Battle of Britain, um, the 80th anniversary. Um, this flower bed, they always seem to have like, um, like monuments and um, celebrate special anniversaries like Queen's Jubilee and things like that. But um, some amazing flower beds in this place. So as we're down here on the seafront, I hope the wind's not too noisy. But at the entrance to Green Hill, you have this arch. This is the um, commemoration arch to commemorate the reign of Queen Elizabeth II. Um, it's only been here about a year. It's reasonably new. I don't really know much about it. There's a little plaque here. There you go, celebration arch to honour the longest reigning monarch. Yeah, there you go, officially opened 1st of April 2019. Nice little cafe there. Oh, because of the lockdown, it's still closed at the moment, but hopefully things are starting to lift. But I love all these houses up the top of the hill here as we're walking along the path here. Like I say, these flower beds are work in progress, but there are many more beautiful ones a little bit further up. So just along here we've got some beautiful terraced gardens and more flower beds. Loads of seating areas, loads of benches here to sit. And then um, just here we have a, a wishing well. Um, it was built in the 80s. But, uh, all the money that's thrown in there is given to local charities, which is nice. Just along this section you've got all these beautiful little pastel coloured beach huts. All of a beautiful view of the sea and the bay. There's paddle boarders out in the beach, people on bikes, people swimming, having a stroll. Beautiful morning. So up this top far end of Green Hill, you've got this kitchen pot. Um, it's, again, because of the lockdown, it's not open, but it's a 18 hole little kitchen pot. And then over this side, you've got some tennis courts. A nice cafe just over in the corner there, Jurassic Cafe. Been in there loads of times, lovely. And um, again, amazing views of the bay. Love it here, love Weymouth. Let's just have one last look. Got the pitch and putt over there, got the old well, beautiful flower beds, beautiful scenery. Just up the end there is where the arch is. Another flower bed here, and then just at the top here, I have this weather vane with an aeroplane on it. And that's to um, commemorate the air speed record that was set in 1931. It was set by a guy called um, Lieutenant George Stainsford. Um, he used to go to Weymouth College, which is just over the back here. And um, yeah, 1931, he set the air speed record. I um, can't remember the name of this plane. Schneider Supermarine S6B seaplane, apparently. Done over 340 mile an hour, 547 kilometers an hour in 1931. So, that's to commemorate his achievement. And here we go. Thank you for visiting Green Hill Gardens. Hope you enjoyed your visit. Certainly did.
We've got to say goodbye to the little owl sat on the roof here as well. <laughs> so if you like this video and you want to see more, um, give me some ideas of what you want to see. Like, share, subscribe and um, I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.